Listen, stop doing questionable things. You can't guarantee that someone else is going to think that what you're doing is harmless just because you hope that it can be perceived that way. The story I'm gonna show you next, these kids thought they were taking the proper process to do something that could be questionable if they had just done it without asking. Unfortunately, it still went bad. But again, the moral of the story is, don't do questionable things because you're still putting yourself at risk and you can get Picture shot. Picture perfect setting. That's what two teen boys saw when they pulled up to this home in Conifer on Tuesday afternoon. This isn't an easy one to figure out why this equaled that. Jackie Kelly says Jefferson County Sheriff's deputies are baffled. How did looking for a place to take homecoming pictures result in a boy being shot in the face? They parked the car uh, at the gate to the property. They did go over a fence and walked to the home and uh, knocked. They wanted to talk to the homeowner and see if they could get permission to take photos there. She says no one was home. They walked back to their car and um, started writing a note to the homeowners asking again for permission to take photos for homecoming. Um, while they were writing their note, a uh, black truck pulled up. Kelly says Brent Metz, the homeowner, was driving that truck. He got out and fired a shot through the windshield, a single round hitting the 17 year old in the face. The affidavit shows one of the teens heard Metz say, oh, my gun went off. There's nothing that we know of yet that made sense for him to step out of his car, point a gun at these two juveniles and fire a weapon. A picture perfect setting now marked by violence.